Hey there, fellow Tarnished! Welcome to Playpedia GG. In this video, we will explore the world of Elden Ring. Today, we're delving into heavy hitters, the Great Axes. At number five, let's start with a classic favorite among warriors, the Great Axe. It boasts the highest base damage of all great weapons, which include great axes, great swords, and great hammers, making it a powerhouse on the battlefield. Found early on in Limgrave, this beast of a weapon demands a lot of strength to wield, but fear not. You can wield it with just 20 strength if you opt for a two-handed grip. And here's a pro tip. Infusing this weapon with fire will allow you to buff its damage with Flame Grant Me Strength. And when combined with the Claw Talisman, it will make your jumping attacks hit like a truck. Next up at number four, we have the Crescent Moon Axe. With its above average reach and hefty damage as the third strongest Great Axe, it's a force to be reckoned with. It is known for its heavy attack combo, consisting of wide sweeping attacks that are perfect for crowd control. And guess what? You can easily farm this beauty from the soldiers in Stormvale Castle. Spice it up with a fiery infusion and an ash of war like flaming strike and you'll be leaving enemies in ashes. Coming in at number three, let's talk about the butchering knife. It may not have the damage of its fellow great hexes, but what it lacks in attack power, it makes up for in versatility. Need proof? It's the second longest and one of the lightest great hexes in Elden Ring and requires only 16 strength to wield. Oh, and did I mention? It restores 1% of your HP with every swing. Talk about slicing and dicing your way to victory. Enhance its potential with keen affinity and multi-hit ashes like Wild Strikes or Sword Dance. And for that sweet, sweet HP region, don't forget to pair it with talismans like the Blessed Dew Talisman. Sliding in at number two, feast your eyes on the great Omen Killer Cleaver. With damage numbers close to the Great Axe, it's a cut above the rest. Plus, it's the only Great Axe with native bleed buildup. The Great Omen Killer Cleaver is also a breeze to wield with very low requirements at only 23 strength and 12 dex, making it a very versatile weapon. The possibilities are endless. Infuse it with fire, dual wield it, or pair it with a Great Shield, the choice is yours flexibility at its finest. And finally, at number one, we have the Executioner's Great Axe. Picture this, longest reach, hefty damage, and a crit modifier that'll make your enemies knee heal. Perfect for a guard counter build thanks to its awesome reach. You'll be landing those guard counter hits left and right. And that crit modifier You'll be breaking enemy stances in one to two hits, allowing you to land those juicy crits. Pair it with talismans like the Dagger Talisman and the Great Shield Talisman to become an unstoppable force. And there you have it, fellow Tarnished. Great axes are filled with power, versatility, and endless possibilities. Which Great Axe will you wield on your next build? Let us know in the comments below. Until next time, happy adventuring in the lands between.